In the previous videos, we showed you how WordPress and Yoast SEO can kickstart your SEO. Our plugin takes care of a lot of things and it will make your life easier. But our plugin can't do your SEO for you completely. Creating content obviously is something that you will have to do for yourself. Of course, you can outsource it, but it remains a task that requires human effort. So in this video, I'm going to tell you what you need to do for yourself to make your SEO strategy successful. So let's start with a little low hanging fruit. What are the simple things you can do to get quick results? Well, first of all, if you decide to install Yoast SEO, you need to configure the plugin in the right way. Our configuration wizard helps you to easily configure your site to have the optimal SEO settings. Just answer the questions in the wizard and we'll implement the right settings for your website. This is really important because optimal plugin results require an optimal configuration. That makes sense, right? But let's go beyond the plugin. Even if you decide not to use it, there are lots of things you can work on yourself. For instance, you can start by choosing a good, lightweight, responsive theme that works well on all devices and doesn't come with a million features you won't use. To make your site faster, you can install a caching plugin and maybe invest in a good content delivery network, a CDN. These tools help you get your content to your readers faster. And you have to think carefully about what kinds of content you add as well. Adding images to your posts and pages, for example, makes your content come alive. But more often than not, these images turn out to be way too big. You need to optimize them. And you can do this by hand, but that's a lot of work if you have a site full of them. It's better to install an image optimization plugin that helps you to do this automatically every time you upload a picture. Remember, and we have said this before, be careful not to add too much. Sometimes site owners install dozens of plugins for everything under the sun. This can really slow down your site and maybe even pose a security risk when one of these plugins gets hacked. Only install plugins that you actually use. And in addition, please make sure to always back up your site. We can't stress this enough. Now, let's get to the bigger stuff. Some of the things you do to optimize your website simply require a lot of work and thinking. One of the most important examples is keyword research. It's a vital element of your SEO strategy. Keyword research is a process where you try to determine the search terms you want to be found for. You need to ask yourself several questions. What audience am I trying to reach? What search terms do these people use? After all, what's the use of optimizing your page for a term nobody uses? In other words, what's the use of ranking number one for Passerin when your target audience mainly searches for Songbird? And there's another factor you should take into account as well, your competition. Google the key phrase you want to optimize your page for, and then check how many companies are trying to rank for the same term. How big are these companies? Would you, your own site fit between these results? As we've mentioned before, you're going to have to write some awesome content. Yes, our plugin gives you feedback on your writing to make sure that it's readable and SEO friendly. But still, you have to write it. And there are some things that an automated program simply cannot accurately spot, like whether your writing style is engaging and fun to read. Another thing no plugin can do for you is setting up and maintaining your site structure. This includes organizing your homepage and your menu, creating categories and tags, but also setting up a good internal linking structure. We've talked about this before, but it's especially important for SEO. Without a decent site structure, both your visitors and Google will get lost. And that's not only a waste of your efforts, but it can also be bad for your rankings. It works similarly for social previews and redirects. Our premium plugin will help you to create great posts on Facebook and Twitter, but still, they need to be written. 
And our redirect manager will stop you for just deleting posts, but it remains your job to determine to which new post you should redirect the old one. Whenever there are choices to be made, it's up to you to make the decisions. Okay, let's sum things up. The most important things that Yoast SEO can't do for you are keyword research, writing content, and setting up the structure of your site. Our plugin offers tools and feedback to make it easier for you to work on your SEO. But still, there's a lot to be done. It takes effort and it takes time. So don't despair if you're not ranking overnight. If you're just starting out, you're probably not the best result yet. Or maybe your rankings suffer because the competition is very stiff. That doesn't have to mean that your page isn't valuable. Maybe it will just take some time. But on the other hand, maybe you just need to put in more work into becoming the best result. In any case, put in effort and make sure your website offers a great experience for your users. If you do that, you should be on the right track. So good luck.